Okay, my dudes, it's going down today in a first blood elimination match. We have two heel factions going head to head. The Judgment Day and the new Street Profits run or managed by Bobby Lashley. We're putting Bobby Lashley up in the match today with Andrew Dawkins and Montez Ford. Heel Street Profits, bro. I'm digging the heck out of it. I'm digging it, guys. I'm literally digging it. Do you know what? MVP done his thing, but I feel like Bobby Lashley managing the Street Profits. Oh, wow. Perfect. Like, don't get me wrong, right? MV, MVP done his thing. He took superstars to places, to heights that day they maybe couldn't have got to. Or well, Omos is that one exception. I don't know what happened with Omos, man. Omos was never meant to be. I'm going to be honest with you. Omos was just never meant to be. Plus, he lost every single match. Regardless, anyway, Bobby Lashley managing Street Profits, turning them heel. Oh, I don't know who had that idea. I honestly, I guys, I have no idea who would have ever thought of turning Street Profits. We want the smoke. Yo, come on, man. Turning Montez Ford, one of the funniest guys in the business, into a hill. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. I'm loving it. I'm hearing it. I'm liking it. I want to see more of it. Oh, my God. Going up against Judgment Day at the moment. I love that faction. Like, I'm digging the heck. As soon as Judgment Day was created with Edge, I loved it. From then, I knew it was going to be a faction to watch out for. Why do you guys think that when I started to hear or, or see that Judgment Day could potentially get broken up? I didn't like it, bro. I weren't feeling it. I felt like it was a hurt business all over again. Judgment Day hasn't reached where they need to get yet, right? They haven't dominated the way they should. They need to get to that height. Stay there for a year, maybe even two. Then do... The, the, the shenanigans of breaking up because you know sometimes factions just don't stay together but you damn it we could have a whole thing we could really Jimmy judgment day could be together forever we could get one member out another member in maybe have someone else join you could always you could have judgment day there forever the way judgment day is it doesn't need to break up we could when a superstar is sick and tired and needs to rest WWE or they just want to get out of the storyline like maybe Finn Balor is sick and tired of it kick Finn Balor out Maybe Damian Priest wants to have a single one and he's sick of being a, a part of Judgment Day. All right, cool. Kick him out. Get someone else in. Judgment Day still be there, bro. Because I'm telling you right now, Dominic and Rhea Ripley, they won't do good on their own. They need to be part of Judgment Day. So Judgment Day needs to be alive. Do you know what I'm saying? Because let me tell you now, I've said this countless amount of times. I'm going to say it again and again and again. Dominic Mysterio is the best heel of this era, okay? I don't give a damn what anybody says in, in the world, okay? Dominic Mysterio slapped Ray, and we all thought that was like, oh, damn, this guy just made the biggest mistake of his career. What's he doing? Oh, no. No, he didn't. No, he didn't. Dominic Mysterio made the best decision of his entire life. Of his entire life. Ray, his daddy, took him to the height where he needed to learn the moves, learn the business, learn WWE. And he done it. Oh, damn, did he do it. Yes! When a superstar can turn heel and everyone boos so hard that you can't hear him talk, you know you've done something right. Oh, damn. I don't feel like Dominic was destined to be a face. I'm not going to lie. He hasn't got that persona to be a, a face. Who could pass it open? No way, Damian Priest. Did Bobby Lashley just bust Damian Priest open? He damn did. Come on, man, Dominic. You need to get your payback on him. Oh, damn. Damian Priest is out. Damian Priest, that's the muscle. That's the giant. That's the, that's, that's what judgment they couldn't lose. Oh, my days. But listen, guys, if you've been watching recently, Dominic Mysterio has been going up against all these crazy legends. He's been doing all kinds of stuff. I'm digging it. Oh. Finn Balor tried to help. Bah! Oh, did it hit? It, it kind of did. It kind of did. I can't, we can't be seeing anyone else get busted open here. Bro! First but elimination matches are very, very, very unpredictable, and I love them. Come on, man. Come on, Dominic, man. Bring it home. Bah! Woo! The laser kicks down right there! Come on, man! Do not let... Oh! Bro, go after, go after Lashley. Oh! Dominic Mysterio, bro. Do not let your guard down. 
when it comes to any of these superstars. Because I'm telling you right now, you're going to get whooped, bro. Rhea's not here to help you. Rhea is going to bro. Oh, damn. You go to the street. Probably there's a two on one action right here. All it takes is a reversal, man. All it oh, Dominic's out. Dominic's out. Hot Business 2.0 is here to dominate WWE. Hold on. This is pack mentality. This, this, this is not what you wanted to see. Bobby Lashley. Oh, he's stunned. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. This is how it's been. Guys, if you've been watching our first blood matches, you know it's so unpredictable. You don't know, never know what's going to go down. And let me tell you one thing right now. Judgment Day got owned. Judgment Day just got owned right here. Oh my days. Oh my days. Oh, the hurt lock. The hurt lock has been locked in. Look at this. Bobby Lashley showing her street profits. This is how we do. This is how we do. Pow. They're going to learn from the most vicious man in WWE. Bobby Lashley. Look at this. Montez Ford ain't not a funny guy no more. Oh, he ain't a funny guy no more, man. Yo, Montez Ford, he not smiling no more. Bobby Lashley ain't not a more fly, bro. No, I ain't. <laughs> Montez Ford will miss. Oh, damn. Come on, Finn Balor. You got this, bro. Finn Balor. Ooh, this is such a mess. Damn. Pow. How did that not bust him open? Whoa. Bro. Dude. Just remember, anything can happen. It just takes a reversal to bust someone open. But at the same time, this could do it. He's down. Pow! Running power slam, bro. Bobby Lashley really teaching him how to do it. Look at that. There you go. That could be it. Nope. Whoa. Dude. Bobby literally teaching him the right way. Bobby teaching him how to do it. This, this, I'm, 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 I'll be honest with you guys. I think Street Profits will do really well as Hills. They really will. They're honestly, it, it's going to be very, it's an, exact, it's an exciting time to see what they can do as Hills. No, no, we've seen them do what they needed to do and face, but now Hill, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty excited, especially run by, uh, under the guidance of Bobby Lashley. So, oh my days. He has a steel head, an iron head, bro. His iron damn head. Finn Balor's just taking too much beating right here. Still steps. Still step. Oh, man. Pow! He's stunned again, damn it. He's stunned again. Oh, 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 oh. He can't do nothing. Look at this. Pack mentality. Oh, he done it. Dawkins done it. That was an annihilation. That wasn't a match. That was a damn lesson. That was a damn message to say we are here. We are here. We are about to dominate WWE. This is perfect. I cannot wait to see some epic storylines with these dudes. Dude, I'm telling you right now, please, WWE, do not give us another hurt business where you just cut this whole thing off. No, make this last. Perfect. All right, guys, hit me up in the comments below if you want to see the new hurt business go up against anyone else. Maybe the shit. Let me know in the comments below, man. But until then, I'll see you guys in the next episode. My dudes.